What's going on guys, if it's out here, and today we're going to do uh, this build over here. Now this actual hidey hole here with the cave, it is, uh, has a gas mask on as you can see there. If we go in without the gas mask, we, we will get um, gas damage as you can see there. So this whole place is gassed out as you can see there, there's little breaks in it. Like you'll get all the way down, it's quite a big cave, and then you've got three chests here. Uh, you won't get gas down here, but then again, if you stand here too long, you will start getting gassed out. So, with this build, you're definitely going to have to have a gas mask on. I've got a lot of crap in my inventory, but well, there we go. And we're going to clean these guys out, which we cannot. It's hoping that we could, so that's going to make everything a lot tighter. As always, this is going to be the first build in here. We are not going to stack this all the way down because it is quite a long hole as you can see here it just keeps going and going might as well try that one too, nope and this last one, nope nope as you can see it's quite a long hole so we'll probably try and stack the front here a little bit even that there's um yeah I don't think we'll be stacking this very much but with these kind of builds you can always just place the foundation down and repair it with a repair hammer and you should be fine so we'll just see how we go there's a little book here but it's absolutely nothing so it's actually a bit interesting why there's nothing on here at all but there is a book in there as well and if you want to have a look at the map we'll jump on the map before we start here uh, just right there that's where we are at the moment Alright, so let's get straight into it. Uh, we're going to turn on the build mode here. Once that free build mode is on, we can get started. Alright, so our first foundation is going to go down the bottom there. Now, I'm not too sure how we're going to send this all the way down. In fact, I really don't know at all, so it's just going to be trial and error, but that's going to be our door for entrance. Now, we're not going to worry about stacking this because I think it's going to be hard enough to get stuff down there. But um, it's so zigzaggy and so long, I don't think we have to worry about that too much. So let's try and continue this down. Uh, what we're probably going to need is like a ramp or something. I'm going to try anyway. Um, let's try the ramp and the stairs. We'll try both there. Uh, we'll come down to here. We'll put the ramp down. Which one should we take? kind of want them all down. Alright, let's uh, take the wall. Alright, so we've got the stairs here, it's come straight down, so that actually looks pretty good. And then we can have a foundation after the stairs, just there. And let's try another door, let's zoom into the character here so we can see what we're doing. If we can get that right angle. Not letting us zoom in here. There we go. Oh, that apps looks horrible. Alright, so let's put um, the door here. Because we can, and if we can get through this door, yep, it's good enough for me. Bit of a tight fit, but that works. Let's put another foundation there, and we'll just put some fence foundations on that to make that look legit. Uh, it's not going to go on top, but we'll put one there as well. Now, annoyingly enough, I do need that wall there. So let's put the wall. Don't know where I want to put it. Alright, let's try that one. All those pieces I can't use them, so it's going to be hard anyway. Uh, but let's put that guy there. And now let's. Um, there you go, we can turn like that. That's actually pretty good. That's coming out that way, and even that way is good too. Right there, I'm gonna have to change up, but you really could um, stack these doors in, I guess. Let's have a look, see what that looks like, and see if that works with us just uh, moving around. Doesn't look like we can get into this guy here. So this one gets deleted, no, that gets deleted. And uh, we'll 
put that floor back. Uh, this one looks like it has to get done. And uh, we can walk through there. Alright. Still, that is pretty good. We can get through here still. Good. So we are getting there. We're actually getting the job done. It's going to be a struggle all the way through this. As you can tell, it's quite tight. Uh, this one we're going to put another triangle piece there and let's try this door frame here again nope let's try the other side why does it keep deleting that one uh, let's try that not, not gonna work either is it oh it does work well wow, that's a tight door but that's good it's working so here we're going straight so let's do our foundation but I want to go down with that foundation so we're going to come over here and we are going to delete this fence stacking or the fence foundation that we did there is that a foundation? not too sure, let's wait until this rubble goes again that was the foundation so we can't do that so we're going to go there and then we're going to go to the fence foundation we're going to lower it like that guy and then we are going to put this fence, get rid of that, put the foundation down like so. And then we are going to lower it again. We possibly could even use steps there. But um, let's see what this looks like. Look how much room? We've got quite a bit of headroom here. And I can still just step up that. Probably because of that fence foundation there, but that works really well. It's like a tiny staircase. So that's good. And then we're going to go down again. So over here we put a fence foundation stack. We're going to get rid of that guy. Go down like that and get the foundation. Try and go down with it. not allowing me to go down so let's try this and then the fence foundation there so it's dropped again get rid of the foundation and then try and put one down on this level it will accept it on this side but it won't accept it on that side so we're just going to play around see if we can get this going so we're going to put see it just won't go down there so we're going to put that guy there then we're going to get rid of that guy Well, we can still fit and we still go through so I'm going to keep it, that is pretty good and now this one is way too high so we're going to go with the steps on this guy to get down there and I'll wait until that clears out but as you can see we're slowly getting through here now as you can see there could be another couple of doors that could be just put up here one here, one there and one just before these steps uh, we put a foundation over here just to make it look good. Alright, now we come down and we got another foundation here, which is actually not a bad level. And then let's go steps again, because so we need to drop quite a bit. Alright, so now we're running into the ceiling. I don't like that. So we're going to lower this foundation here with this guy. So fence foundation, there we go. Foundation, lowered. Alright, so we got a little step up there, and we can walk straight through there, it looks like. So let's put our staircase and try that. Absolutely perfect. So let's go foundation. Got a nice little hole there. And um, let's drop this guy again, it looks like. And we should try and do um, these corner pieces too, because that kind of aims it back up to where we're going which is down there so let's uh, drop this guy so fence foundation see if we can go right there and triangle piece that's been dropped a little bit which is perfect foundation looks like we're still going to go with the foundation here but 
wouldn't mind dropping that in a little bit. Wait until the rubble goes so we can see what we're doing. Alright, so it's not going to let me go up against that. So let's go here. Bench foundation. Delete this guy. Foundation. Now that's been dropped. Take the fence foundation, drop it again if we can. Doesn't want to let me do it. You can go. Yeah, that's not going to drop in there. But we got this little steps going here, so that's good. We are going down with the cave and we're not getting trapped in there yet so that's good so let's go here fence foundation over here drop it delete the foundation and then try and put it in a bit lower there we go now we've got the step down just from doing it from the other side now uh, there's lots of little pain in the ass things with these building pieces so as long as you keep trying these steps you should be able to get it uh, as you can see we are hitting the roof again which I don't want to do so we're going to try and drop this guy out once again so let's try and get this fence foundation right there and let's try and drop it like that come back this way delete this foundation and then we'll try and put it in at the lower stage we just made right into this rubble There we go. Now we can walk through. Can't walk up there, so let's try and fix that with something. Um, it's not going to let me, so let's try deleting that. Ah, uh, because we can't drop this fence foundation down. One. If only we could drop that down. We should have that, but um, it's not going to happen. Or we can try putting that guy there, and then no. Nope. Wait until that rubble disappears. It's pretty fiddly. Sometimes it's got to be built a certain way. I think that worked. No, nope, we're still up pretty high. Oh, we might just need a jump there. Let's try that. Yeah, she works. Alright, so we're going to go with that. Uh, so now we've got this guy here. We are going to drop it again. So we have to get rid of this fence foundation and then make a lower one. And then foundation. And so we're in a bit of a sitch here. Let's try, that's going to work a lot better, look at that. So what I did there is just two triangles. And that turned that corner really nicely. Now if you're following along with this, I doubt it's all going to line up exactly the same as me. We are just going with the flow here and I'm hoping for the best. Uh, that is going to be way too short. Yeah, way too tall. Uh, so let's um, try and drop it before. So we we'll get rid of that guy. Let's foundation. Wait until this is gone. Or we might even be able to just level that out with that. Yep. So we just drop that triangle there. And now we're going to delete this guy and try and drop this guy again. Because we can't do this fence foundation off a triangle, you're gonna have to go with the whole fence, the whole foundation, drop it there, delete this guy, and then put it in at the level you just dropped to. I hope that makes sense, but um, yeah, you can't go off the triangles. Alright, so let's jump in there. Looks like we can squeeze through alright. Uh, fence foundation here. Get rid of that one, and I want to pull the lower one. 
like so. Triangle piece is going to have to go in there. Then maybe a foundation. Drop the foundation. 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 And we've made it in. That was a bit of a mission, so I hope you guys um, made it inside too. But um, we're in now, so that's good. Uh, with these boxes, you can always destroy them. And sometimes they respawn. Some of the other builds you've probably seen me, they have respawned. So let's grab all this stuff. Looks like we're just getting silver and gold. And whatever else is in that wooden chest. Uh, let's fill this guy in as well. So that is looking pretty good. Set for right there. We got one spot where we have to duck. Considering another spot where we have to jump. Considering what we just built through. That is pretty impressive. Uh, so that is going to be the basic build setup there. As you can see it's quite a distance to go. And you could add so many more doors. So let's add these doors on the way back. No, we can't do that one. Establish that. And we're going to go down there. And we're going to put a door there so when they blow that up it goes to nowhere. Because why not? I'm going to put a door there for the same reason. And a door here as well. Can we go with a door there? Yes we can. We have to squeeze through a little bit. But that's alright. So we're going to foundation that off. Wow, that is such a tight spot. Well, we can only come down, not up. Oh no, we can go. Now that that's a tight door right there. I don't even know how we managed to um, get in there. You have to climb and then well that's a tight spot but that is another door. And we're gonna have another door here. Another door up here. They're mainly distraction doors on the side there. So they pretty much go nowhere. I'm gonna cover that guy in. You know what, we're going to turn this into triangle pieces. See what we can do here. Once this rubble disappears. Let's go with that as well as a triangle piece. I wonder if this um, right in here, someone can decode it. Wouldn't that be interesting if it's an actual thing, fun comes done? You just need to find a way to decode it. That would be pretty cool. I doubt they went that far with it, but it would be awesome if they did. Alright, so triangle pieces there. Why have we got triangle pieces there? Because we can put boxes in there. So let's chuck some boxes in these guys. I don't know if it's going to let me. Yeah, right there. And then you get your triangle pieces back and you just cover up the boxes. So they're like, no, not even there. Alright, beautiful. So and let's get a six here, a ceiling piece with a foundation on top of that. Come down here, beautiful. Uh, on the side there. Yeah, we're gonna leave that. Uh, so we come down here, we'll put more doors along the way. And that's we're going to try that guy. It's a little bit high but I did see the fence foundation that did land on that that one right there. And wait till that disappears. There we go. And the door there it looks like. It's good. Uh, foundation there, foundation up there, foundation there, and uh, foundation there. Uh, door here, foundation. Very nice, we need a duct there. More doors. go. Uh, we're going to foundation the side here. Uh, this is 
bit of a need to squat down, is it? Nope, it seems like it's it's changed on me a bit there. Uh, we did just get through this. No, it's not letting me back down. Alright, that's a bit odd, but let's see if we can drop this guy. So let's get rid of that. And then put up that level. And that did the job. Start to duck, but we can actually get through here. So that's good. Let's put another doorway there and another doorway just here. And let's see if we can duck in there now. We sure can, but it's still a bit of a tight fit, but it is good. I'm going to get rid of that guy. That is doing the wrong thing. So let's try and triangle that like so. Triangle there. Kind of fills it in nicely there. Yep, I like that. And let's try and do some more doors here. This guy, not too sure about this one, but it works. Uh, let's go here as well. And then that's going to be the entrance in here. So beautiful. And let's block this guy up on the side here. Right there. But yeah, if you guys were getting raided in this building, I will just replace, say right here, bam, with the foundation, get your repair hammer out, get some materials, and just sit here and repair it, and you'll be fine. Obviously, you can do that closer to the start, and you can just fall back as needed, but this place, honestly, if you guys were online and they were trying to raid, good luck to them, because I don't think they'll be doing it. Uh, let's try and get rid of these boxes and see what we can do in here but it looks like it's going to be a bedroom and storage now to get rid of boxes i just like chopping them up and they seem to go they got a lot less damage than um, your no normal boxes world boxes can't take a beating usually like when you're with a world boss or something they usually just disappear on you especially when you're trying to use them alright so there they go they're gone We'll find out later on if they respawn or not. So let's get uh, some ceiling pieces here and see what happens. Uh, we'll put a wall there. So we'll go this guy in the corner. It's not going to go in there, but that's good enough to cover. Alright, so there's ceiling pieces here. gonna go around like so and I'm gonna need something here so we can kind of step on to look up I think that's what we're gonna do so we'll take out this one and we'll cover this guy here so the step up is in that corner yeah I think that's what it's gonna be then we might get off a chest or something up there I'm sure we'll figure out something uh, so let's get some bed down here. But I hope you guys are still with me because that was a bit of a build process getting that through that hole there. It wasn't easy at all. Uh, let's try and get this bed way out the way just like so. Uh, for tight spots I do like using this bed. It is one of a kind. It's the lowest capacity bed that you can actually get. Might even try and use this to stand on though. So let's try that. Yeah, that's not too bad. We should be able to access whatever up here. We're definitely not climbing up there. But that might be alright there. Of course, we could use boxes too, but I don't mind that. Let's see if we can place boxes up there. Just standing on top of this bed. Sure can. Let's try this way. A bit more. Mm, 
See if we can access that box at the back there. Yep, sure can. Alright, so that's pretty much the boxes up the top there. Now down here we want a fridge because you always want your buff fish or all the good stuff can go in a fridge really, so you're always gonna want a nice fridge hidden away somewhere. So that's what that guy is right there. Now let's try and get some more boxes down because the boxes are important. I've always tried to build like a leaning tower or something. Starting on a slope like that and then try and build the tower. I always thought that would be pretty cool but um, I haven't got around to it yet. seen that flick off and there she is But yeah, what's good about this um, spot is you've got that extra gas that will carry out the raiders as well. They'll have to use a gas mask. That so just means they're not using full armor, which is always good as well. Let's still get through. Yeah, I can crouch my way through. That's all right. Then. Well, it's gonna let me do it. Wow. Well. Okay. I don't know unless you try. Oh, let me put it up there too. But can we still? Yeah, we should be able. Right. Right Alright, so we can access all those boxes, which is really nice. I think it's going to let me put one another one up here. But I'm going to try anyway. Nope, that seems to be it. Get one in there. No, I think we're pushing our lucks with these boxes. Alright, so I'm going to leave it as that. And then uh, we're going to build something out the front, it looks like. Because we're going to need benches room. Or we could just have this as a hidey hole, but you kind of want to use this spot. Because um, yeah, if you're getting raided, you do want to be here. This is a deep hole there. Such a maze getting in and out. Like it's not fenced out but it kind of feels like it just because it's such tight quarters. Oh, we've got going there. Not too sure it's um... Is that a foundation hole here? Right, let's get through this little door hole here. This is the one where we have to uh, jump and then duck. Still surprised that's actually working. Yeah, that just 
just makes it look a little bit more legit there. Got a duff there. Uh, this door here, once they break through the door, they hit a wall straight away. It's very nice. And we can go with another door here. Yep. Foundation here. Alright, so that is going to be that hidey hole. That's pretty cool if you ask me. Kind of like that. But let's build a little building out the front here as well. I think it just needs it. If we want to start using benches and that, we're going to need another hidey hole here. So let's start with this guy here. Obviously this one here is going to be the entrance. Let's see if we can use it. Up to get in, no problem. Uh, on here, we're going to have to have a ceiling piece. Now, looking at it, and uh, we'll just put foundation on top of that, too. All right, cool. All right, so now to make this look like a house up against the rocks, which you can kind of tell it is in a cave, but I don't think people are gonna not know that you're in the cave, so it's gonna just be how it is here. That really blocks the cave, that tree, but it is a pretty good shrub. But because we're building around it, no need for it. And let's go out a little bit more. if I want to completely block this off or not let's do it see what it looks like take these out see what it looks like it's not too bad there can we still put one underneath no So we can have two foundations blocking this guy. Let's leave it for now so we know where we stand. Alright, out here, let's go with the stairs. Foundation. Plenty big now. It's a nice little house out here, but you can really just make like a big building out here. You know, some people just go crazy with their builds. But that's what we're going to have for now. And then let's enclose it. So, what do we got on here? Let's look at our glass panels. I do like the glass in the new DLC, it is pretty nice, these guys. I wish there was a glass ceiling place. That would be pretty cool, but you just got all this glass that's um, bent and all that, which could work with that as well, but I wouldn't mind just the ceiling piece. That would be nice. Alright, let's just go with some walls. 
because this is not much defense out here it's going to get blown into pretty fast but as long as you have enough time to get inside your little cave here I think you'll be right and with the foundation at the front door so you could just block this with a foundation and sit behind that door and keep repairing it honestly you'd be pretty safe if you're doing that I hate that mechanic, I really do, but honestly it's in the game guys, we might as well use it. I'm hoping they put like a time limit so when like your wall gets damaged you can't repair it. After a certain amount of time, I think that would be um, really good for the game to have. Because the repair hammer is a bit overpowered at the moment. Can we put that in the ground at all? Don't know if that went in the ground. No. That's going to be a little house at the front here. Well, for what it is at the moment, not too bad. These outer houses are more just like a work station outer house thing. Alright, this is uneven and I don't like it. So we're gonna go on deleting spree. I'm gonna take out this one here. Yep, just like that. Alright. Not meant to be this side. Alright, so there we go with that. And we'll get rid of this guy too. Yeah, it's not going to let me put one there, I guess, because of the trees there. So we're going to have to chop that guy down. and we're just going to delete these guys on both sides because now I want a gateway there because gateways look cool no other reason so let's put that guy there like we're not stacking this or anything we're just fixing her up put some stairs there we go Looking good, and we'll get our axe out so we can clean this tree up. Mm, that first person with the axe is so odd. Alright, so there we go. All we need now is some roof ceiling pieces. So what are we going to go with? I'm not too sure, but let's have a look at all these guys over here. Now I haven't really used any of these, and they're just looking like end pieces. That looks like a middle piece. Let's have a look. Um, not really good to have these in PvP but at the same time this isn't the part of the building that we're trying to secure so it might be alright here I'm going to have to do some more PvE builds uh, there will be, well, I've been live streaming as well and I'm trying to make a castle on like a five time server 
because I was doing the PVP servers but they kept on um, getting full and my pin wasn't working with it either this is really fussy with the pin they said they were going to fix that so we'll see what happens but there is that now let's try and find those corner pieces the corner uh, that looks about right there uh, these guys haven't got glass anyway anyway Still looks good. There we go there. Now what are we going to put in the middle here? Can't really just go this guy, can I? Just doesn't look right. Let's see what else I got. I've got those spiky bits. Weird shavings. Well, All these these bits. Don't look too bad like the other DLCs. I really like these pieces, but um, yeah, it's not too bad. It really gives that that look still the textured roof look. It's better than just a ceiling piece. Uh, it looks like we'll be able to cover this without putting a pillar in, so that's fantastic. But I wouldn't mind trying to place bombs through those little gaps. It'd be interesting if you can do that or not. Ah, uh, this tree yeah, needs to go. No minor indoor tree, but that one's not. That one's no good. We'll try and keep this one. See how we go. Let's have a look on the outside of this thing. These building pieces are really like intimidating looking. All that gothic look, which is pretty cool. It's pretty nice. Uh, what else have we got here? There's a few pieces we haven't used before, but um, yeah, let's go with these. Let's see what that looks like with the light. Kind of blocks it a little bit. What else have we got? We got these guys. They probably do a bit of job. Yeah, I think that looks better. And it will still keep the light coming in a little bit too, which is good. Obviously, we're not stopping people from climbing over. But yeah, they, look, they do look alright. Yeah, I wonder if I can um, play stuff inside the... Uh, I would say you can place bombs through that gap. So it's something to definitely watch out for. Yeah, definitely. But that's alright, as I said before, it's not PV not a PvP place out here, this is just for the workbenches. And we'll just make try and make it look a little bit more pretty. It'd be good if those statues were on these ones that I'm taking away. So statues look alright, and I think they look better with that gap in the middle. Alright. And that's our door. Oh, that, is that the top of the door? That is really thick. It's probably like the first gateway that actually has a full foundation width on top. So it's interesting how they've done that. But that's cool. Alright, let's get down. Break a leg. Oh. And then we're just going to make this look a little bit more fancy in here too. Just with these guys. And this one here. What are we going to do up there? Probably have arches up there. I think that would work well with this build. <sighs> and that's going to be the block. And then we're going to have some guys up here as well, probably more arches. Wait. Oh, 
Nice. Well, I think that's going to be it. And now I'm just going to fill this place out with workbenches, but we are pretty much done here. So if you actually haven't seen the walkthrough of this video once it's finished, because I'm going to leave it here and you'll see when this is finished and it's full glory, make sure you look at the description below because that video should already be out. And I'll talk to you guys next time, but make sure you hit that like button and that bell for any more builds that are upcoming. And make sure you jump on the Discord as well as Facebook because there I try and give some early access information. So if you guys want to see some of that, make sure you join those. But other than that, I'm C Free Zone and I'll catch you guys on the next Hidey Hole build because there's many to come. See us.